it's time to move forward and to see the next step. The Bugatti Chiron. This is the Chiron, Bugatti's 2.4 million euro successor to the Veyron hypercar. Bugatti describes it as the most powerful road car ever to reach series production, although with volume limited to 500 cars, we are not talking about a Vauxhall Astra here. But true enough, it does have a lot of power, 1,479 brake, that's 1,500 metric horsepower, which despite the fact that it weighs almost two tonnes, is good for a 0 to 62 mile an hour time of less than two and a half seconds. It'll reach 124 miles an hour in less than six and a half seconds and 186 miles an hour in less than 14 seconds. Its top speed is limited, limited to 261 miles an hour. Now, I'm sorry about the amount of numbers here, but this is a car that is defined by them. That is eight miles an hour faster than the original Veyron and even a couple of miles an hour faster than the later Super Sport version. But it is slower than the 267 miles an hour set by the world record edition of which Bugatti only built five. Now, one reason for that is that drag increases at the square of speed, so you need masses of power to increase the top speed even by a little. The other reason is that tyre technology hasn't moved on sufficiently to allow the Chiron's full potential to be released. All of this is slightly academic anyway, because just about the only place you can reach 261 miles an hour is at Volkswagen's own test track. Anyway, mechanically, although the Chiron is a new model, it has a similar technical package to its predecessor. There's an 8-litre W16 petrol engine in its middle, driving all four wheels through a reworked version of the Veyron's impressive seven-speed dual-clutch gearbox. Torque vectoring can vary the amount of torque at each of the rear wheels for what Bugatti calls an easy-to-drift function. Yep, drifting a two-ton, 1,500-horsepower, two-million-quid hypercar. If that sounds like your bag, get your order in fairly quickly. More than 150 Chirons have already been ordered. One customer wants six of them. So there are only 350 left. First deliveries will be in October 2016.